What is up, guys? Okay, so I was just lifting in there, and now I'm out here by the pool at Gold's Gym Fullerton, right? Um, I'm a little bit sad that my first video I'm putting out from the road is not going to sound incredibly positive. Um, I'm a little bit frustrated. Um, I pulled a dumb move, and I think I just strained my back. No joke. Um... The trip already has had, oh, some setbacks, but we're okay. Um, we left today, as I record this, it's Friday, December 5th at like 12.45 p.m. Um, like I said, we're at Gold's Gym in Fullerton, California. But when we took off from Sacramento, our first stop was San Francisco CrossFit, right? Which was an awesome experience. Um, that typically is about a two-hour drive due to flooding. It took us seven hours, you guys. Seven hours from Sacramento to San or to San Francisco. Anyways, almost three times, no, over three times longer than it should have because of flooding and the Golden Gate Bridge was like going from three lanes to one. And so that happened, right? Also, the day before we took off, um, we found out that our LA week long um, where we were supposed to stay didn't quite pan out so one of um, the people we were supposed to stay with had a, a, a sort of emergency in message us like literally the day before we're leaving right and we're like um, actually we can't host y'all and we're like shit okay so we were thinking alright well then we'll just go stay in SAC after we shoot at San Francisco CrossFit for a few days because then we can come back to LA. We're shooting at Barbell Brigade tomorrow, um, which is in like central Los Angeles, I think. But um, luckily I have friends that live here in Fullerton. Um, Dr. Pablo Costa, um, he went to grad school with me in Oklahoma. He is a professor here at Cal State Fullerton, um, an exercise physiology professor. And I called him up and I hadn't seen him in forever anyways. And I was like, dude, let us come see the campus. We can come, we'll chill out for a couple days and then go to Barbell Brigade, right? So we did that. So luckily, um, he pulled through. Awesome, awesome dude to host me and Brandon for a couple of days. Um, and tomorrow we go to, again, Barbell Brigade. Um, in the afternoon, if you're in the LA area and you want to come like between like three and four tomorrow. We'll probably be there from then till about six or seven. I'd love to meet you guys. Okay, so that being said, it's been an eventful trip thus far. It's only been like two and a half days, right? So I get here, we kind of feel like, both me and Brandon, we kind of feel like shit, right? Um, just lack of sleep, being stuck in a car. Yesterday, um, I did cardio like outside. I was just running around and did like some push-ups and shit. Today is my first lift on the road and I was so excited to come here. And um all kinds of things are just off and then I hurt myself. Um first off, we spent $30 to get into this damn gold gym. Not to sound shitty, but it's a $20 day pass. But then they say like, well, but if you you can either just pay the $20 or you can buy something in the pro shop that's like $20 or more, you know? All the girl shirts are $24. So I just, I don't have it on right now. Don't get me wrong, it's a sick shirt, but it was like $30. And then with tax, like $28. So it cost me $30 to get into this gym, so I'm kind of pissed off in my brain, right? Again, travel has already changed three times. <laughs> um, missed breakfast. And we're kind of in a hurry. I'm out because I'm skipping out on part of my workout because of my back just now. Anyways, I'm rambling. I'm sorry. Please stick with me. Uh, so we're kind of in a hurry because we, we're going to go see the labs uh, where Pablo works at Cal State Fullerton after this plane goes by. Uh, so we had to get in a quick lift and we didn't really get to sleep in and like we're sleeping in different surfaces. And my mind was not in my workout it was not in my workout I go down for my second rep of front squats last working set and I don't know if I didn't I wasn't thinking of my, my breath like I should have been I wasn't focused and I just strained my back like yeah I can move or whatever you know like I think it's like my lat. it's like the middle like when I breathe in like it hurts um 
not excruciating and because I'm still warm but I felt it finished my eight reps and now here I am like wondering I'm supposed to do Penley Rose I might skip out on that but I have a big we're going to Barbell Brigade tomorrow and I want to lift heavy and hard and I have the big three tomorrow and everything was perfect and I just I let my lack of focus contribute in you know my my stubbornness like once I know that this one I'm doing front squats at 125 for eight I knew it was gonna be a little rough it feels way rougher than it should and I know that a lot of that's exhaustion lack of sleep my brain is somewhere else I should have dropped weight I have the freedom to drop weight and I was like fuck no I can do this weight I'm just gonna keep it and power through and it was heavy and my body's off and my mind is off and then I got hurt um, because I'm stubborn you know and I don't know what this video is about again like I'm just frustrated and there's so much cool shit going on around me and we have so many things coming up and I'm like stressed out and my brain's not in the good things right now um I don't know um <laughs> I think I'm stressed because I start prep in three weeks and the whole point of um, this week with, with my coach was like, okay, dial down, quit eat, try not to eat out so much. Be, and when you do eat out, overestimate your foods more, which has been easy or whatever. But I just, um, I feel bad because I want my groceries and my foods, you know? <laughs> and I feel bad because I'm, we've been on the road so much, I'm not getting the work done that I want to. I'm not replying to the emails that I want to. I haven't like shared anything to you guys like I want to. And the first workout on the road, this shit happens, which might affect tomorrow's workout or a few workouts, you know? Um, I'm trying to put a bow on this video and wrap it up for you guys, but I don't really even know what it's about. I think I just had to, I don't know, get out my, I guess my like anger with myself for not being smarter about my training. Um, my anger with myself for not being present and enjoying the things that are around me instead of being irritated with all the things that have gone wrong. Um, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't, again, I, I don't know what to tell you guys. I don't have any advice in this video. I don't have any how to, or this is how I, whatever, because I think I'm fucking up right now, you know? Um, but I'm going to go in, Brandon's in there actually having a decent workout. I'm going to go probably not, um, Probably not row, but maybe finish my overhead presses and I'm supposed to have pull downs. Probably won't finish that either. But um, this, um, I appreciate you guys for watching this because it makes me feel better. Maybe that's about it. I just needed to vent and feel better. And I'm going to go in there and finish. Okay. Um, I'm hoping and praying that the next time I do a video from the road, it's not so freaking negative. Um, I love you guys. Thanks for listening. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.